Hello and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about Cock of the Rice. Now for this uh, Slayer monster you'll need 25 Slayer, 25 Combat, and 20 Defense. The reason you need 20, uh, 20 Defense is for the Mirror Shield. Because if you go in there without using the Mirror Shield, you're going to be losing a lot of HP, a lot of prayer, and your stats are going to get drained quite fast. So it is a requirement to use this item. Again, you can pick it up at any Slayer Master. Not too sure how much it is. Probably maybe a K at max. I'm not too sure. <laughs> um, but overall, going into these monsters like we've been talking about, you're going to be getting um, items like the Mystic Boots, which is roughly around 12K. Um, and then Herbs, Herbs, Herbs. It's one of the item the items that we're going to be picking up a lot throughout throughout our RuneScape Slayer career. Raynar 7K, Avito 3K overall, yada yada yada. Now a tip I have is going into ground items if you're using Rune Light and scrolling down. Now for me, I have like files, ashes, coins, all this stuff. Um, blocks I don't see it because it's annoying because you get a lot of this stuff drops but putting up your height under value at 1k now again for this example it would be hiding maybe some wall runes water runes fire runes unless they're stacking on top of each other maybe you might want to pick them up maybe not I don't know so should you bring some food maybe you can bring some food if you want um we're going to be doing the fairy ring teleport there. Now, for me, I'm going to be using this fairy ring teleport, which you can run around over here because there's this gate opening. Or you can, if you're in the GE, just go through here, which level 21 agility, which I think a lot of people use this um, if they don't have a fairy ring in their house. Now, again, going forward with your accounts, after you've unlocked the already teleport, doing all the e star going uh, quests, I, I think. I forgot which one it is, but you have to go to West or going to unlock RD and all that. But once you get this teleport, your next um, goal for your account, in my opinion, is to unlock fair rings. Because again, fair rings are spread everywhere. There's one down here. There's one. They're just all over the place. It's um, <laughs> They're really convenient. And again, um, it's just a thing that you should be unlocking. But from... So where these monsters are at, so is in this Slayer Cave up here, which we talked about when we went to go see, I think there were cave crawlers. We teleport the Camelot, ran up here, crossed the bridge, and then went into the cave. Now again, you could use the house teleport if you have it. But we're going to be using the AJR method, which right there, it goes straight to the cave. So again, fairy rings are going to be really important moving forward with your accounts if you haven't unlocked them. Now... Again, I think if you've done hard diaries, I'm not too sure of, I forgot which one. I think you unlock a ring or something where you don't have to use a Draymond Staff. But again, I haven't done that. So I'm using Draymond Staff. So when you do the quest, make sure you pick up a few more branches so you can have some more Draymond Staffs in case you lose one. Because you don't want to go all the way back and get another um, branch to get Draymond Staff. So we're going to be using that. Um, so pretty much all I'm bringing is some stamina potions and three food. Again, the mirror shield is a requirement so you don't die. So hope you guys enjoyed and see you in a bit.
Hello, so welcome back. So we have killed a few of them. We've actually got pretty lucky. We got a Rainar Sea, a uh, Rainar Weed, and we got a Catatine. Now we have Gold Drop up, Gold Drop. So, but a lot of people, there's the Ring of Wealth right there. A lot of people don't really want people to use the Ring of Wealth. They want them to use like a recoil. But if I'm doing like Slayer tests of easy monsters, I'm gonna be using a Ring of Wealth. Just because uh, my armor, like this armor is pretty much OP, but when I was using Dragonhide, I was doing quite fine. So I always recommend the Ring of Wealth just because it picks up the gold for you. But also your drop rates increase a little bit so you can get more herb drops and stuff. So I always recommend the Ring of Wealth because I always go back to the Grand Exchange and sell my loot. <laughs> so some people may not like that. Some people like just use a recoil, but again, I'm using the Ring of Wealth. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and see you next time.